After that truck rams into a crowd in Nice, uh, there are a lot asking around here, should there be tighter security for Bastille Days in Milwaukee? Ann Sterling tells us festival organizers talked about extra security before the tragedy in France. There are no security checkpoints at Milwaukee's Bastille Days. No bag checks, no metal detectors. But organizers say security is a top priority. We have been um, very much um, in close communications with the Milwaukee Police Department for weeks. Kim Morris is the executive director for the East Town Association. She says security measures are being stepped up right now. Bikes, horses, you know, you name it, we have obviously ramped up our security. 250,000 people are expected to attend this year's French themed festival. And unlike Summerfest, people can walk right in without stopping at a security checkpoint. That's something organizers don't want to change. I hope not because I think this is one, um, a festival that everybody loves uh, for the fact that it's in an urban setting and uh, they can come and go and they don't have to pay an admission. I think stepping up security would be a good idea. Bailey Wyckoff comes to Bastille Days nearly every year. She thinks after a truck plowed into a crowd celebrating Bastille Day in Nice, security should be tighter at all of Milwaukee's festivals. She's not alone. They, they need to get a little tighter with security. You um, just got to make sure, you know, uh, it's a different time. Ann Sterling, today's TMJ4. And organizers tell us they are talking to the mayor's office right now about having a moment of silence on Sunday for the victims of the Nice attack.